and positive theory is about examining motor skills in sport, how they were learned, and suggests it's sequential how we learn each stage. Cognitive is the initial stage. The learner tries to create a mental picture. Demonstrations and verbal instructions are very important for understanding and linking movements to get the flow of the skill. The teacher will give two to three key points known as cues for the learner to focus on. This is called selective attention. The performer will be inconsistent, lack flow and coordination and will be full of errors. This is where positive feedback is needed. For example, when being taught the serve in tennis, the teacher will demonstrate the skill and explain key coaching points. This enables the learner to form a mental picture and visualise the skill. The next phase is the associative phase. This phase usually takes longer as some never progress from this phase as it's here where errors are eliminated and fundamental skills are learnt well enough to appear smoother and more aesthetically pleasing because the learner focuses on specific and relevant points. They then refine the skill in different conditions. For example, the learner's already got the mental picture of the tennis serve and practices it. The serve falls short of the net so the teacher gives feedback so the learner can focus on what aspects of the skill are going well and those that are not. The learner then tries to correct the faulty aspects of the serve. However, if the learner can't do this, they return to the cognitive phase to refine their mental mental image. The learner then progresses on to the autonom autonomous phase. Here the learner develops the learned skill so it becomes automatic, which involves little or no conscious thought whilst performing the skill. Not all performers will reach this stage. Rehearsal of the skill must be done regularly and correctly. For example, the learner will now be able to correctly and consistently perform the tennis serve rarely making errors, proving the skill can be performed with no thought at all, so the skill has become automatic. 